Hello guys, Brot here. Uh, before we jump in the video, I just want to say a big thank you guys for helping me reach 1000 subscribers. You really helped me grow my channel and I'm really grateful for all the support. This really means a lot to me guys and it wouldn't be possible without all of you. So thank you so so much. Uh, regarding today's video, a lot of you guys have been asking me if Aura Far is good with the new changes. So I decided to make a video and tell you how I feel about it. So guys, sit down, relax and let's jump right into it. So guys, Aura Far is made by fusing electric zone uh, with incineration and it was buffed uh, twice in the last few updates. Uh, the thing with the fusion is that it deals standard damage when you cast it, but as it travels it deals higher and higher damage. It used to deal 6 times the normal amount at the end, uh, they buffed it to 8 times and uh, now it deals 10 times the initial damage when it reaches the end of its expansion. For research I took a standard page taking the entire third row with all the damage uh, possible and mana refined and uh, some other uh, research points as well. Uh, for subject I took spirit and uh, for the fusion I mastered the electric zone with uh, double damage uh, possible masteries. Uh, I also decided to take earthquake which is uh, frost Novo with meteor and, and I also took constellation which is made by fusing fireball and satellite. Uh, the thing is that they all have a really strong uh, area of effect, really strong AOE around the character, so I decided to go with them. Uh, for Frost Nova I took uh, area and damage, and for Fireball, Fireball I took number of Fireballs and damage as well. Uh, I think I managed to survive a little bit over 30 minutes in Arboretum, uh, which guys is pretty much nearly the maximum you can uh, survive at the moment with a standard build. For artifacts I had uh, pretty standard ones uh, except the mechanical arm, uh, which uh, boosted the number of fireballs for my constellation. I also had mirror to increase uh, the number of fireballs even more. Overall guys, Aura Fire is both strong and not that, that strong. Uh, it indeed deals pretty high damage now, uh, but, but with the current uh, scaling of the enemies, uh, pretty much all good fusions struggle really hard after the 30th minute. Uh, overall the fusion is pretty enjoyable to play with, deals uh, high damage and has uh, really great uh, area of effect, really great AOE. If you haven't tried it, I really suggest you do guys, you can try it with some different side fusions and some different artifacts and uh, tell me how you feel about it. As I mentioned, currently the best way to get high times is by going with an insta dead build, which my next video will be about. In the meantime, guys, you can uh, feel free to ask me anything in the comment section, I always try to answer uh, each one of your questions. And as always, thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, feel free to like it and subscribe to the channel, guys. Have a great day and see you soon, bye bye.